Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nick Kyogre Kawai. We're here for IBA Little Cup, our week seven battle against Shark Dad, who is a new opponent. I don't believe, yeah, I don't believe I've ever faced them in any draft league before. First time battling them, so excited, excited to see how it goes. They have quite a uh, quite a scary team. All right, Yamper. Uh, I was not really prepared for Yamper. I actually didn't prepare at all. These are all Mons I just had in my box. I did not even prepare for this battle. Um, so we got Yamper, Goldeen, Azuril, Gibble, Vullaby, Krogunk. Um, hmm. Interesting, interesting. I feel like there's not that many answers to that. Uh, my Squidward, the Inke. So I'm just going to lead Inke because I feel like it's pretty solid. But anyway, go check out my opponent. Again, links in the description down below for Shark Dad. Again, he is the coach of the Gilbert Galvantulas, who is in this season so far 2-4. and four. We're 5-1 and one, uh, heading into week 7 here. And then we have one more battle week 8. I pretty much I am guaranteed. I'm pretty sure I'd be guaranteed a spot in playoffs. I don't think I would lose it, being that I'm at the top of the ranks right now. So... Honestly, I can just kind of have fun these last two weeks and not put in a ton of effort into team building just because I'll make it to playoffs. But if I do maintain the number one spot, then I have a bye the first round of the tournament. So that would be cool. Oh, nice. Leads off with Krogunk. Does Krogunk get a bug type move? So that's the only question I have is what does bug? Does get X Scissor. Does he bring the X Scissor predicting this thing? And what would switch? I'm just going to click Superpower and I'm just going to see what happens. Oh, he's got Nasty Plot. Okay, well, there's no special bug type moves that he gets, so. And I'm going to be boosting my defenses. Or no, wait, what is it? I get an attack and defense, but not special defense. So he could actually do some decent damage with like something. Oh, I didn't mean to click that. I kind of wanted to click the other move. Focus Blast. And he hits the plus two Focus Blast. That might KO me. Wow, okay, it did just KO me. Not gonna lie. Was not expecting that. Um. Dry skin. I didn't bring Psychic on this thing. Poison fighting. It's actually kind of scary, not gonna lie. Yeah, this thing's actually kind of scary. But if he has dry skin, then he's kind of weak to fire. So I'm just gonna go out here and click Flare Blitz because... I think that's what I want to do. Krogunk putting in the work, though. Is anything going to be faster than Litten? Not really. But I have to kind of Flare Blitz. I can't really over predict because if, if he stays in and I go for a Swords Dance, then he can just get like a free KO onto me. And I don't want that, so. All right, I'm faster, Flare Blitz. Mmm. Mm -hmm. I burn it, but I do recoil damage to myself. And he goes for Sludge Wave. Which, wow, this thing just took out both of my bulkiest Pokemon. Pretty impressive. Not gonna lie. Oh, I forgot I had Earth Power on this thing. Okay. 
So we go out into Amora. Just gonna lock myself into freeze dry here. It's got vacuum wave. Bruh. I, I kinda should have known that. I guess I should have prepared for that thing. He's gonna die to the burn. Wow. This thing just like killed half my team. Crow gunk is crow gunk scary. But that's the only thing that really like beats Gibble or beats this thing, I feel like. A uh, Yamper. A little annoying. But what does Yamper do? Yamper. Could like paralyze me with nuzzle, which would be annoying, I guess. But I'm just gonna call mine out. I feel like I kinda gotta just go for bold plays here if I'm gonna win because I'm down I'm down some Pokemon and he's still got five left. Oh he just goes for Volt Switch. Alright. Who does he go into? Goldeen. Okay, what is Goldeen? He like Goldeen. Think it's a steel type attack dude if he has a steel type attack on this thing then then props to him because he just prepped really well for this battle and i can't be mad but dang ah it's got lightning rod i forgot goldine got lightning rod so it's a water type okay so he just goes for a waterfall but he is physical dang he brought the physical goldine with waterfall Okay. Hmm. I guess I just go for a Giga Drain. Oh, I have Water Absorb. Maybe he's Choice Band or something and he's stuck in that move. His Waterfall can't do anything to me. I absorb the water. What's going to happen next? Just staying in. He's just letting this thing go down. He just wants a free switch in into something else. I'm guessing it's going to be Vullaby. Probably like Dark Pulse, Air Slash, Nasty Plot, Vullaby. Yeah, probably. Robs. But on the off chance it's physical. He does go for knockoff. But the focus sash. Focus sash protects us. We can strength sap and get full of, get get a lot of HP back. Not all the HP. So he still might just be able to KO here. He goes for knockoff again. Bruh. That crit. I was going to say that had to be a crit to KO. That's on Fort. <laughs> wow, that was like the perfect time to get a critical hit. But he let the he let the other thing go down. So now I have Star You out. And I can just click Ice Beam here. And KO that thing. Let's go, Star You. Let's just let's just sweep. Let's go, Star You. 
I believe in you. It's all on you, Star You. Let's go. Dang. Should have ran. I can't believe I forgot about Vacuum Wave on Krogon. Krogon just ran through my team. Azuril is normal fairy. Pretty strong. Um, I guess I just go for the Hydro Pump. And hope that a Life Orb Hydro Pump can do something. Almost KOs. Alright, it gets its berry juice back. It goes knockoff. That does big damage. Gets rid of my life orb. I can click recover here. Oh, Aqua Jet. Knock off into Aqua Jet. Good play. You know what? Honestly, that was some awesome. Oh, because it's huge power. I forgot Azuro gets huge power. Nice. Nice. Well, GG. That was a good win. Good battle. Um, hopefully we get to face each other in playoffs because I'd like to, I'd like to like prep against his team a little bit harder. I honestly wanted to, I just, uh, I didn't end up and I, and I wasn't like really stressing about making sure I did the preparation because I knew we were pretty much set for playoffs and honestly, not gonna lie, not that worried fighting, flight, fighting slightly salty, uh, week eight and, uh, not too worried about him. So, uh, <laughs> but anyway, thank you guys for coming out to this video, keeping it short and sweet this week. Hope you guys enjoyed the battle and are enjoying IBA little cup. And we're going to be moving on to the playoffs here soon. One more week of the regular season. So be sure to check that out next Saturday, 10 AM. As always go follow all the other coaches down below so that you can watch all the battles. Cause there's a lot of entertaining Pokemon draft league battles happening again, every Saturday, 10 AM. See you guys next time. Bye.